The port of Tilbury is probably the third largest port in tonnage terms to the UK economy. It's being close to London makes it a very important vital transport and transshipment uh, place. The Port of Tilbury is excellent at operational flexibility. We have a team here that I believe is second to none. We work very closely with the customer and we will work extremely hard to meet their objectives and targets. We have uh, a number of key clients, uh, large major organisations that uh, do business with us. Our main cargo uh, is containers, um, forest products as well as aggregates and bulk. So there's a general spectrum across the whole port. We've been in business for 135 years. We have huge growth plans for the next 135 years. We have classically trained operators by the old approach, experienced drivers, teaching new operatives how to operate that plant and equipment. Well, I, I sit on the board of directors for Tilbury on the Thames Trust and our objective here is to train a, a number of ex-military personnel. Key thing here is availability of equipment and damage limitation. When we trained, um, it was a three-week course. It actually went on for more like two months. Availability of key cranes, for example, um, if you're busy, you cannot free that up for training time. Because the, the cranes were needed as operational pieces of equipment working on vessels at the time, so the training was elongated out. The biggest benefit for us using simulators is moving away for that potential to damage operational equipment and make mistakes in an environment where they can make mistakes. When you put new people into big machines, they will undoubtedly have small lumps and bumps, um, which are quite costly. You can do damage without actually doing damage. It's, uh, it's a way of learning from your mistakes without physically having the consequences. There are some of the sources that suggest that something like 80% of those trained on simulators have a reduction in incidents or accidents on the main equipment when they move to it. And I've seen the simulators in operation and I'm extremely impressed with what they do. The deciding factor for CM Labs was their global credibility. Uh, CM Labs have huge experience in delivering simulators to the port sector. I think it's the way forward, I think it's unique, and I think it puts us ahead of the competition. I was really surprised. It's unbelievably realistic in every aspect, and I've, I've really put it through its paces and tried every single thing. The Vortex Simulator is a great piece of equipment. It has changed the way we are. It's opened us up to ways of monitoring, measuring, increasing productivity. There are a number of factors that we're looking at which we would never have looked at if we'd remained uh, with a more traditional approach to our training. Working with CN Labs has been an absolute pleasure. The responses that we've had have been absolutely first class. We've had to do some tweaking for bespoke equipment. They've met our target every time that we've given them a challenge. I'm very impressed with CM Labs. The professionalism in which they conduct themselves, um, fantastic.